Hey everybody, welcome back to Our Planet Studios. I noticed something this morning and hold, you might want to sit down for this. Battlefront 2 and the original one is obviously are coming back to PlayStation 4 and 5 and I think Switch as well. I haven't seen anything from Xbox, unfortunately, but I mean, honestly, they're all playable on Xbox anyway, so it doesn't really matter. But I figured I would do something different today and do a reaction of the trailer. So this is going to be the PlayStation trailer. And uh, yeah, here we go. Your simulation days are over, Trooper. This is a real battle. Right, no retreats. Man, I wish it was this coordinated. No now get out there. Oh, that, that's awesome. Star Wars Galaxy. Wow. Classic Battlefront games. Man, I wish the battles were this coordinated. And split screen local gameplay. Wow. Fight with heroes. Never tell me the odds. And battle with villains. Get ready for the Star Wars Battlefront Classic Collection. I, I just really wish pre-order now. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. Well, Battlefront's coming back, everybody. So uh going through this, um I'm gonna kinda click through here a little bit. Uh we got Stormtroopers in the Death Star map. I just wish Oh man. So the nice thing about these trailers is how how nice everything looks. Cinematography, everything like that. All the troopers all lined up with the TX-130 and everything. Looks amazing. But that never happens in the game. Wish it did, though. <laughs> Man, that's awesome. Yeah, with all the droids lined up in front of the AAT and everything. Yeah. Well, for those of you who have not played these games, it will look pretty close to this. Uh, the problem is most of the AIs are pretty old and they just kind of wander around all over the place so it's still fun there's still battles going on all over the place but it's not quite as centralized as that um, for the most part though the rest of this is pretty cool I love how they have all of the uh, Jedi and everything all lined up on, on Yavin and everything and then the original like hero versus villain map uh, most likely have a, has all of them all lined up against each other there that's pretty cool too Man, and then they have Battlefront 1 as well, so they're doing, like, air combat support and everything. You have the Death Star thing with all the Rebels and Stormtroopers all fire. You won't see that in-game, unfortunately, as cool as that would be. Because this map is actually considerably larger than, than just this room, so... I don't know how it'll be. I haven't played XL on that on PC. I'll have to try it. But, uh, yeah, so it might, might be that. It might be denser. I don't know. But for the most part, most of the AIs are just going to be kind of wandering around all over the place. Which is a little bit of a bummer, but, you know. All right, see what else we got here. Goes kind of into more realistic, like, what what it's going to actually be like. Uh, we got Hoth, we got all these guys laying around. We got split screen coming there. You can see that on the Naboo thing with uh, Obi-Wan and Darth Maul. Uh, as well as the space battle there with... Man, that looks so much cooler. So, yeah, another thing that that's little bit deceptive on it. it looks amazing is the only ships that are the capital ships that are actually in these maps are the three ones that are facing you there those ones that are kind of sideways in the background are just background details like they don't actually exist so as cool as it looks and as fun as it actually is that's not quite what you're going to be getting in that uh, going forward a little bit more we got pilot luke uh force pushing some uh some snow troopers that you can do. Um, we got Mace Windu doing a ground pound on, uh, I believe that's Coruscant. Yeah, yeah. So I'm guessing that they're bringing the heroes versus villains thing to more maps than just Mos Eisley, because the original Xbox version only has Mos Eisley for the hero assault. Because uh, they have the Tantive Four here with Vader and Leia and Han Solo there. And then it goes back to the, the other maps as well. Um, you get, yeah, see another one here. I mean, every map you get heroes like Utapau like this. You know, you have, um, what is this here? We got General Grievous. We got Obi-Wan. They're kind of facing off on this kind of round command post four, I believe that is. 
that you can do because each on each map each hero or each team gets one hero that they can choose from if they get enough points so yeah this is gonna be awesome my gosh and yeah so this this little screenshot here of Naboo with the AATs and everything this is from Battlefront 1 they do actually line up like that I've seen the AI tanks like, kind of like stage up on the hill and just kind of start pounding the center of the map it's pretty cool uh, the ATST getting hit by the uh, what are these the the log trap things that does happen I'm thinking this screenshot is from Battlefront 1 but I can't quite tell uh, but yeah in both games it happens like that it's the same map um, you got the best bin I believe that's the Battlefront 2 version oh obviously because it has all the heroes in it um, you can tell because the, the lighting is a little bit a little funky a little too dark for what it should be you get the the Rancor from Jabba's Palace you got this awesome picture of like all 64 units on each team just stacked up on the on the bunker command post here that never happens this many people if you're doing like an XL mode like a 64 v 64 all of these people will be spread across this map like this map continues way off to the left and pretty far off to the right and then there's the whole inside of echo base there as well so most of these guys will be spread out through the entire map so as cool as it looks in the trailer it's not quite what you're getting um, yeah I think that's about it well thank you guys for watching this video I'm excited for this even though I don't even have a PlayStation um, I have all these games on PC and uh, Xbox as well so I play them anyway but uh, hopefully you guys pick this up it's gonna be awesome and I will see you guys in the next video